Hi, my name is Tommy. Oh. And today I'm going to read a book about. Oh, wait. Uh. Land of Dinosaur. We are going on a magic adventure, said Chip. The children went through the door with the magic cups. Oh, help, said Libby. The magic took the children to a land of dinosaurs. I want, I don't want this adventure, said Libby. I don't want to meet a dinosaur. A dragonfly flew by. Look at this, said Chip. It's a giant dragonfly. What a big one. Chip found it a footprint. It's a giant footprint. Come and look, said Chip. It must be a dinosaur's footprint. Biff, looked, Biff took a photo of a giant footprint. I can take this photograph to school, she said. Nadine found an eggs, some eggs, they were big eggs. They must be the dinosaur eggs, he said. One of the eggs began to cry. It's going to hatch out, said Biff. Something came out of the egg, a little monster. It's a little monster, said Nadine. Something flew by, the children were frightened. What is it? asked Chip. I don't know, said Biff. The children ran to that. It's a flying dinosaur, said Nadine, and it's a big one. Come on, let's hide. The flying dinosaur flew down to the eggs and picked it up a little dinosaur in the teeth. Oh no, said Biff. It's going to eat it. She picked it up a stick and ran out. Go away, she yelled it. The dinosaur flew away, but Chip was cross with Biff. You were silly, he said. It, it could have got you. It could have got you. Wolf ran on and climbed, climbed it a hill. He wanted to look for a paddlesaurus. Come up here. Come up here, Biff, he called it. You can take a photograph. <laughs> Wolf had now climbed it on a hill. He had climbed it on a dinosaur, and it was enormous. It looked it round that wolf. Wolf was frightened. Oh, hell, he said he jumped it down and ran let's get out of here he called it don't be frightened said jim it's a, a paddlesaurus it's like one of the museum it will hurt us it won't hurt us if the kafudu graph it with the long neck it's got and what a long tail she said, I need a bigger camera. A paddlesaurus ran into a water with an enormous splash, said Wolf. Nadine looked it frightened. Oh, help, he called it. Another dinosaur was coming, and it looked very fierce. Let's get out of here, yelled it, Chip. Biff took a photograph. Come on, yelled it, Chip. Don't stop for that. This one could eat us. They began to run away. Wolf's other shoe came off in the mud. Suddenly, the key began to glow. Just in time, said Chip. The magic took children into Biff's bedroom. What an adventure, said Biff. I've got some good photographs. This is the fierce dinosaur, said Biff, said Chip. Did you take 
It's photograph. Yes. Except this. Let's tell mom and dad. I took photographs of dinosaurs, she said Biff. Oh yes, said Dad. Well, I'm sorry, I didn't have a film in the camera. Camera. That's the end of the story. Did you like the story? It was the end of a dinosaur. That's all for today, so bye!